brother. What up, y'all? You already know this man. It will be King, aka Rain Man, aka Izzy Real, aka the Gunline Sniper, aka Mr. Evans. Man, we live right now. What's poppin', y'all? What's going on? You know what, I got a question for you. What's that, bro? Uh, it's, it's, it's Music Man, everybody, from MySpace page, from YouTube. Um, I heard you was on the Come Up Show. Oh, Pine 99 man. FM, how you get yes, on there? Sir, yes, sir. First of all, I'd like to say shout out to Power 99. Shout out to QDC, Cosmic Cap, the whole Come Up Show. I did something on World Star, they put it up. Um, it, was a, it was a freestyle to the whole city of Philadelphia called Dead Philadelphia, just talking about all the beef and all the reckless stuff that's going on. And I guess Guys McKenna got a whiff of it. I don't know who put them on, QDZ or which one did it, but I thank everybody up there. They spun the joint like two, three times I heard. They said they spun it like it was a record, man. So all I can say is thank you, man. I, I salute y'all because... I feel like I'm the underdog, and for, for a dude like me that don't represent gunplay, that don't represent selling crack, none of that stuff, to put me on a joint like the Come Up Show, it feel good, man. And, and, and before I even get any further, I'd like to say I heard some people tell me that Cosmic Cavs was like, he liked the joint, he liked the direction I'm going in, but it was something that I said at the end that kind of bothered him on my interview. And what I said was I kind of had was answering a lot of the hate that I've been getting. I don't get a lot of hate, but I get, you know, a couple of shots thrown at me from certain little rappers. And I was basically fed up. So the interview I did, I basically let everybody know, look, I'm peaceful, I don't want no drama. But anybody come at me, I feel like I'm going to bite your head off. And I understand what Kev was saying. He basically was saying I'm hot, but I didn't need that. And I understand because if I got a joint that's that monumental, that they're playing it on a come-up show, obviously I had an impact. So for them to play that and then at the very end have me talk about biting somebody head off, I understand what you're saying, big homie. And I just want you to know that won't happen no more. I'm, I'm, I'm going to keep it on a straight and narrow. And anybody that throws shots, I'm going to be an adult about it. I'm going to try to chill and hopefully we can handle it in like a battle or something. Ain't no beef with nobody. So like I said, once again, shout out to the whole Power 99, QDZ, Cosmic Kev. I don't know who did it once again, but they spit my joint and I love y'all for it. And I got a million more freestyles, a million more songs. And you want to hear it every week on that world stuff, man. So like I said, everybody that's rocking with me and showing support, thank you. Everybody that don't, trust me, you will sooner or later. What's up? Yeah, we see we blowing up on the YouTube. We got so many videos. I mean, the Sharon Page one. The, some people said your your remix of Fill in the Air was better than Beans' original one. Man, I just you know it all come from the struggle, man. Like I always been the, the, the real hip hop dude. Like it was never a fad to me. It was always just my life. Like I never really could make a rap just to make my friends happy. Like most of the songs that I ever did, if you hear them, it's all struggle music. It's all talking about how I struggled, what I went through. That's all I know. But it's like now that I'm getting older, I'm getting a little bit more money, life is a little bit better, I get to have fun. And, and I guess you can hear that with the dead Philadelphia joint because it's, it's serious, but it don't sound so robotic. And like, you know what I'm saying? What I'm saying? It's, it's free flowing. So that's all you're going to hear from that one, man. A lot of good music. I put on for my city. Remember that type. You know what? No big good idea. Man, if you ever make it on there to come up show, make Kev do a song. Kev used to do some CDs back in the day. No. He's endorsed no. a lot of people. No. Kev used to do some CDs for me back then. You know it's Kev. It's real. <laughs> no, you do CDs for me quite a few times. So okay. Imagine, you know, the last one that he did was Bean. So, man, you know, get down with some of these big DJs in Philly. Man, um, peace I'm go. Well, DJ Amir, you know, yeah. we got DJ Rex. We yeah. give these guys a shout out. I mean, dudes. yeah, we got like Cash, Money, Jazzy, Jeff, all these guys. You know, get on with your boy now. You yeah. see, you got the Philly shirt on, Philly oh, yeah, hat on. Yeah, like, I do this for my city. Like, I didn't even realize how, how important it was to say I'm from Philly all day. Like, I didn't realize it because I'm from New York. A lot of people don't know. But I'm from New York, and I always thought it was important for me to always say New York and Philly, New York and Philly. But I kind of started seeing that Philly is very... They take pride in their city, Philly. That, that's, I'll put it like that. So it's to the point that if they start accepting you, it's like, man, you got to pick. Not saying you can't rep New York or wherever else you were born or whatever, but it's kind of like... We accepting you and we loving you. Love us back. Right. And I, and I do 100%. I got Philly on my head, on my back, on my sleeve. I love Philly. I am Philadelphia. So from now on, don't look at me no outsider. I officially got my green card, baby. I'm here, Philadelphia. So whatever y'all need, I'm here. It ain't no beef. And I'm going to do something that y'all ain't expecting. Shout out to Quilly Mills. Shout out to Joey Jahad. Shout out to Reed Dollar. Shout out to Philly Swain. Shout out to everybody. We ain't mad. We get money. It ain't no beef. 
I'm done. I'm officially out of it. If it's good music, call me. If it's beat, I only want hip hop. That's what's up. Shout out to Gilly. Shout out to Gilly, the yeah. king of Philly, man. Yeah. Shout out to Beanie Siegel, Oskino Vasquez, all the old heads that paved the way for it. Shout out to Cassidy. Shout out to everybody doing their thing. I'm not biased. I'm not no hater. And on top of that, I want everybody to know I'm not sectional. So you will not hear me no more it's just Southwest. Nah, I am Philadelphia. Every part, North, West, Southwest, West. I don't care where you at. I've been with every block, every hood. It's not a sectional thing. It's a city thing. So we see here. Also, we got to give a shout to the old like Jack Frost. Oh, man. I mean, he made the Philly awesome. love. What yep. up, big guy? Sandman. Sandman, you know what I mean? the cannons and all that. Like I said, shout out to these yeah. are the dudes that we watched on tour off the streets when right. we was young boys. So right. shout out to everybody that paved the way, Big Star. Mm -hmm. I mean, everybody. Slick, heavy spitters, everybody doing their thing to put the city on the map, man. I bang with y'all, happy. Let's give a shout out to OG, too. Oh, yeah, shout oh, out to OG, definitely. Top Class, Frankie with the Grippers, Touch Money. Shout out to my man, Eddie Morris. He don't even rap no more, yeah. but shout out to Big Boston and the City Morris. Shout out to everybody, man. It's a new day. And they H. And they Kaboom, the whole time. I can't, it's too many. That's yeah. why I say Touch Money. Yeah, Bricks. We ain't see Bricks brick in a while. Roll, free Brick and Roll, man. Yeah, let them know, you know we got love out here. Shout out to Meek Mills. Me yeah, we're doing his thing right now. That's he definitely got the city on fire. So shout out to everybody, man. That's what's up.